there's been a lot of work that's happening behind the scenes and the approach that we've taken with a um, systems approach with the plan has actually made our job a lot harder but I think we've ended up with a better product. Systems thinking is thinking much broader than your just immediate community area. It's, it's, it's thinking in terms of demographics, it's thinking in terms of environment and ecosystems. It's thinking much broader than just your immediate area and how those outcomes in your area will affect other areas and how they interrelate and interrelate. The systems approach looks at what we value in the, in the area, um, what are the things that you want to keep. Um, it's, it brings in uh, not only the physical aspects but the, uh, I suppose the uh, intangibles like the uh, peace of mind, the, um, uh, the feeling that the country gives people um, and the connection that people have o over time. I think what comes across clearly is that people, you know, they, they really value the area and, and, and they love it, not just the people that, that live here all the time but the people that visit and um, I think they'd like to see that we're that we're looking after looking after the region and using their funds wisely and hopefully through the through this new plan approach we can do that. I think the community of the Outback is 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 the, the key partner. It's about the whole of the Outback owning this plan, not just a board, not just another board or whatever it is. So the key partners are just anyone who operates in the Outback, who lives in the Outback or, or, or visits the Outback, has a has a stake in relation to an outcome in that plan. Partners in the plan are everyone, everyone that has an interest or an investment in the Sal region. Um, traditionally we used to think of just landholders um, involved in cattle or sheep grazing, but really it involves anyone who has some sort of activity in the South Australian Arid Lands region and that, that comes down to the tourists that come up from Adelaide or Brisbane as well, so it's everyone.